And one quick note about Heinz Wavering, who is the driver and owner of Toss Out. He has won more trotting races than any person in the history of the world. 10,000. Now, to the top of the stands and track announcer John Bothy with the call of the 1993 Hambletonian. John? Thanks a lot, Dave. The sun is out and here they come. And they're off. It's Giant Chill for the lead. That's American winner in second with High New Star. Tucked in on the inside third. Toss out is fourth. Round the first turn they go. And John Addison Jr. gets to the front with Giant Chill. The leads are a length and a half. High New Star second. Here comes Pierce with American winner looking for the lead as they go by the quarter. Then it's two and a half. The toss out in fourth. King Levesque fifth. High and Chip. The outside six, then it's dry wine with turbo thrust and capital star. 28 and three for the first quarter. An American winner, rushing to the top. Giant Chill in second, two back. High noon star third, and a length and a half to toss out in fourth. King Levesque, the inside fifth. Hind Chip is sixth after that dry wine with capital star and turbo thrust. The half in 56 and 4 onto the far turn they go and it's american winner who leads it by two high noon star stable mate in second with giant chill third moving up a second over trip tossed out in fourth with king levec the inside fifth high chip and campbell coming into contention they approach three quarters and it's American winner, in front by ahead. Right there is High Noon Star. Pine Chip making a big move. Three quarters, one, 25 and four. They're on their way home in the Hamiltonian. An American winner, five, two and a half, three. Up on the outside, Pine Chip is gaining steadily. But with a 16th to go, American winner. And Pip by two and a half, three. It's all American winner. The sword is up for Pierce in 153 and 2. What an effort by American winner. And we have a shot at a triple crown. Back to you guys. Speed and stamina. Yes, speed and stamina. And a very proud Ron Pierce as he drove American winner to victory here this afternoon. John Campbell made a valiant move with Pine Chip, but it was not to be. Trained by Milton Smith, this son of Super Bowl, who was the last Triple Crown winner himself, must be smiling as American winner on the inside, zoomed to the front with less than a half mile to go, and comes home a dramatic winner. And now with two-thirds of the Triple Crown under his belt and heading for the Kentucky Futurity in the fall of this year. He is a champion already and will be back with the color and excitement from the Meadowlands after this.